And Kettering Health Network physicians are seeing more people experiencing side effects from their second dose of the COVID-19 vaccine. Two News reporter Madeline Ashley is live to explain why second doses are causing symptoms. Brooke, while side effects aren't a fun part of getting vaccinated, it can happen. However, medical experts I spoke with say these post-shot symptoms are better than the alternative, contracting the virus itself. The way the vaccines are formulated, they've been tested in a two-dose formula, and to get the full effect of that vaccine, you need to get both doses. Medical experts say regardless of the brand, the second doses can cause unwanted side effects. Um, specifically, what we see most is fatigue, along with um, some people get chills, some have actually had fever, uh, headache. Um, of course, you know, we know there's always some pain at the site on their arm. Doctors say for those experiencing side effects, timing varies. For most people, they last less than 24 hours. Occasionally, we see them lasting up to 48 hours and very rarely beyond uh, you know, the 48-hour, 72-hour mark. With younger people seeing more symptoms. If you're in your 70s, 80s, you're less likely to have these types of reactions. And it's probably because people who are younger have a more vigorous immune system and it's just reacting a little bit more you know, promptly and, and, and more thoroughly. Regardless of age, Dr. Weinstein says that second dose is key in prevention. Very critical for everyone to get their second dose because that's the way the vaccine will have its maximum effectiveness uh, and, and will have a much longer duration. Protecting not only yourself, but those around you. And the more people that are vaccinated, the more people that get full protection, that will help us reduce our numbers, reduce the spread, reduce overall sickness. Dr. Weinstein says while uncommon, if second dose side effects continue to get worse or last more than 72 hours, to contact your primary care physician immediately. Live in the studio, Madeline Ashley, 2 News Working for you.